Okay, so something that I wanted to address because it's come up a bit lately talking to people about sustainability, recycling, plastic awareness, doing our bit to make a difference and that is the um, awareness that the problem that exists on the planet is vast and that as individuals doing our little tiny bit often can seem to be just a drop in an ocean of uh, environmental disaster, if you like. And it's easy for people to feel overwhelmed and to feel like it's too hard and the little bit that they do really isn't going to make a difference in the big picture. And I've considered this quite extensively because I understand that feeling and I understand the, um, the rationale, the rational mind that would feel that. But in my heart, what I sense is that what is actually needed on the planet is a shift in consciousness. And a shift in consciousness comes when we reach a certain uh, mass awakening or, or volume shift, volumetric shift. So every little bit that I do, every conscious choice I make, every... Um, challenge or problem that I, I work very intensely to resolve in my own day-to-day -day living practice, I feel is contributing to the consciousness shift in the whole because I am an aspect of consciousness of the whole and the more of the more of. So the more of us that move in this way and inspire one another and bring it in a happy and positive current the more we will begin to feel um, a sense of possibility and change and positive outcomes are within reach. And I have to say, even in the last um, couple of years where my awareness around these issues has grown quite uh, exponentially, I've also known, and especially with social media and things that get shared on social media, and I do see signs of turning happening um, almost daily now. Like even today I saw something posted about uh, in Victoria passing a bill of rights that uh, animals are being recognised as sentient beings and that they do feel pain. And so that as a law will then move to um, govern uh, many situations where animals do and have suffered and um, there will be legislations to deal with that. So all of what's been done so far does make a difference and does have an impact, not only in the actual thing that you do, but in the discussion that it raises, in the um, consciousness that it shifts, in the awareness that's brought to the whole. And so really, we've just got to keep going and keep being active principal and keep finding solutions and inspiring change and helping people uh, discover that it's actually not that hard and that it's not it doesn't have to be an overwhelming thing it doesn't have to be a, a, a radical thing it can be just a little change each week introduce one little change each week so start with someone who does their shopping in plastic bags and Inspire them to buy some bags. Buy them some bags. Spend 10 bucks and buy them five bags that are reusable cloth bags and remind them to put them in the car after they've emptied out the groceries. That one thing would not only reduce the plastic bag situation for that particular shopper and household, but it'll start to integrate an awareness in them. Then it'll be the next thing. Then it'll be the next thing. Then it'll be the next thing. So... That's what I wanted to talk about um, because I feel it is important to address that um, and there'll be a lot more things I imagine that will arise along the way um, as we consider these things more. But that was what I was thinking about today and I just wanted to share that with you guys. So let me know what you think. Bye.